I'm amazed how open and, and friendly this place is. I didn't expect to see it like this, but uh, I just kind of walked back here. No gates or anything, just kind of freely looking around. Um, they're very comfortable with their uh, locals. Okay, this is the fanciest Safeway I've ever seen with the second stories. And I can actually climb up out to the doors. Okay. Yeah, look at that. There's a second story. You get a nice view of things. I got Safeway. You know, I seriously b doubt Google employees are riding their Google bikes. They even took the label off. I seriously do. Yeah, they took the... Oh, no. No, the warning is still there. Obey traffic lights. Avoid using devices. Use hand signals. So there's no... This bike is a property of Google and for use by badged... Uh, employees only. If spotted off campus, please call. So, even the older style has the warning. Oh, they're using a unique fencing to encourage the uh, vines, I think. That's pretty cool. Okay, so it's Babo. Huh. Hello, citizen. My name is Officer So-and-so. What is yours? Police 1 to Mission Control. Can I get a name check on John Doe? Uh, just be with you in a second, uh, Mr. Doe. Okay, he's come back clear. All right. So, what are you doing here? How long do you plan on being here? And when are you leaving? I gotta say, I really like my makeshift refrigerator. I got this tub. As you can see, it's, it's a big, big tub. It's one of them wash tubs. I can't even pull this thing. It's so heavy. Okay. All right. So I lined the bottom with uh, some, some insulation. And then... I, I just kind of slipped this milk in, okay, and it's really much easier to work with, cover it up with more stuff. I'd rather have, well I do have a cooler, but I'd rather have something where I can make use of my winter clothing in the summertime, okay, for cool, keeping things cool, rather than buying a whole different unit, alright, and using this tub to, to hold it, look at that, you it even says you should hold ice and, and some bottles or whatever. I don't like that idea exactly. I like my idea because I can make use of my winter gear in the summer. It's, it's more practical to keep it. Just like a hundred feet from the library, there's this fitness area. This is great. This is like a perfect setup underneath a tree. You can't get any better than this. Underneath an evening tree to be more precise because of shade All right, so somebody's dropping their stuff off Somebody carried this much. Oh, they all individually huh. Interesting I love this setup. It may not be the most ideal but you got kids playground on one side, softball park, and then the the adults workout area on this side. So they're separated, but 
rated by the uh, the softball field. And so this is the Los Saltos Museum, and they actually had a wedding here just last night. The bride and groom just took their I see I saw their car last night parked in this parking lot, and it just it went. They just drove to the other side of the road to a really nice hotel. But all this is open for the the wedding. And they're saying here that they've grown a lot of walnuts throughout the area. So a lot of their equipment here is dedicated to walnuts. Walnuts are pretty good, but you don't want to eat too many of them. Typically, orchards, workbench. Okay. Some kind of a holer, maybe get the walnuts out of the shell. But this thing. And this is a particular tractor. It's quite small, it's got a, a unique design to it. Specialty. What is this? This thing crushes. You spin this, this vegetable and roots cutter. You throw the roots in this in this bin thing. And then it cuts. Let's see. Alright. Crawler. Rose tree, yeah. Well, they explain quite a bit. I think there's uh, parts of the museum that cost some money. This is a, a, this is a sprayer? All right. So this thing sprays. Oh, okay. So this is a uh, the water tank right here, or the liquid tank, or their special liquids. Hmm. All right. So apricots. Oh, they, they held this. Okay, they, they sun dried them. Huh. And then this is this is all the, like a workbench for the apricot workers. Stay off equipment. Oh, they got it roped off. Huh. That's neat. Whis. Oh, Wiskovich. All right. You gotta lock their truffles. Summer truffles. You have to ask the cashier for uh, access. I could use my food stamps to buy truffles if I wanted to, I, I think. Picked this up at the food bank on Saturday. I don't know why women should be the only ones to get support from raspberry leaf. This is also good for males too. Little, little tea bag. All right, so it may not be absolutely intentional, but I kind of like to think of it in a way uh, for all this free time that I have that I save it for any court cases that may pend against me if I get arrested and need to start fighting it, go on the court. Because I find, you know, me being a novice, I have to go back repeatedly and ask different questions. For guys that have to hold down a job and deal with legal matters, it's a lot more of a challenge. You risk losing your job, pretty much, if you have to appear at a court date on a day that you're working. You know, the climate around here gets just hot enough probably to kill off mosquitoes and ticks. 
which may have led to the Olones being the largest population north of Mexican border. But there are pockets on the Oregon coast, pockets on the Oregon coast with a high amount of mosquitoes and I never really seen any ticks.